Hello everybody, shooting inside the nerve cave today. It's a little stormy outside, just published a stormy time lapse of the, the storm rolling in. So if you want to see that, check it out. Want to use it a transition, go ahead and download it. Uh, just credit back to my channel if you would. Uh, I want to show you my latest prints. Um, this is a wire stripper. Um, it printed out like this. Let's see if I can get a little better look at it. Printed out really nice. Uh, so the way you use it is you put your wire in these different size notches. You push down on this, twist it around, and it strips your wire off. It works really well. I've been using this all the time. Uh, well, let me show you why I've been using it. I've been using it over here to make test leads because I'm reconditioning a Prius battery. Um, so I strip wires down, put ends on them, ends like this, and uh, get some work done. I am printing something else. Uh, I'll show you guys. I didn't put enough glue down on this, so I'm going to see if it turns out. I may have to stop it. But uh, more prints to come. I should mention this holds uh, standard razor blades, uh, same ones I bought for the last video I did on the utility knife. Uh, I bought a pack of them. I think it came in a pack of five or ten. I can't remember, but same blades. I did have to add a screw to this one, and I bought a bunch of screws off of Amazon. It was an assortment uh, screw nut combo. I'll I'll put that in the description so you can see what I used. Uh, various sizes because I'm going to try different things uh, printing out that will take a screw. Uh, let's take a look how it print then I'll demo demo how to use it. Uh, here's a quick time lapse of uh, the wire stripper printing and if I didn't mention I will put the link in the description below of the design to link you to the designer. Uh, let's take a look at it printing. Okay, so here's a, a quick demo of it, the way it works. You slide it in to the hole that fits the wire, and then you spin it around like so. And you just give it a pull, not quite ready. You spin it around. Sorry, I was a little off camera. Spin it around like so to make a cut in the wire and then pull it off and there you go pretty easy really functional tool really cheap easy 3d print and uh, it's got a, a finger hole also so you can you know whatever's comfortable on the way you do it um, pretty cool uh, stay tuned more 3d prints to come uh, I may go a little bit talk a little bit about my printer too I haven't talked about that at all yet uh, it's a real basic one here we are filming uh, another time-lapse of of what's printing outside out there in the garage uh, so from the nerd cave signing out um, check the links below we'll see you next time thanks for watching